Hello everyone. I'm very happy to connect with you all in this wonderful platform, the Dopamine, the Joy of Medicine, the ultimate partner for MBBS journey. So, I am Dr. Arvind. So, I am your pharmacology mentor for your Dopamine, Joy of Medicine. So, I will teach you the pharmacology, so the basic and the clinical aspects of the pharmacology that is required for the second MBBS medical professional. So, pharmacology is a science that deals with the drugs, the mechanism of action of the drugs, the clinical uses, adverse effects and the contraindications of the drugs. So in our day-to-day -day medical practice, we deal with the prescriptions. So all these are mainly dealt with the variety of the drugs in that usually acts in the variety of these systems. So we start with the general pharmacology and we will see the drugs acting on the various systems and also the miscellaneous drugs. So everyone may feel tough with this pharmacology, but I will teach you and I will make you simplifier as much as possible. So we mostly deal with the classifications and it is important for you to memorize all the drugs in the classification. So I will teach you the way to easily remember the names of the drugs as well as its clinical uses. So in pharmacology, other than this, so you will be dealing with all the classes of drugs and in upcoming years also. So you will be reading these drugs as well as the management of this important diseases. So this pharmacology is actually a, a very important subject for you in your MBBS career. So here in the second year, you'll be having two papers in pharmacology. So each paper will be 100 marks. So the total theory will be for 200. And I will also teach you the practical part. So all the chart parts as well as the skill parts uh, that is included in the practicals according to your competency based uh, medical education curriculum. So we will also have MCQ discussions, university question paper discussions, and uh, we may also integrate few topics with the other subjects like pathology, microbiology, and we will discuss the questions according to the clinical scenarios so that it will be easy for you to approach the questions during your university examinations. So all the very best. So we will connect with you. Thank you.